Welcome back to Eva the Tea. I'm Erin Hunter. This piping hot news has been out since June 30th, but she took forever to bring herself to the red table. But now that she has, I'm about to spill all the tea on that Jada and Will type of love. So if you're not cut up, I'll run it back for you. Four and a half years ago, there was a lot of rumors swarming that Jada and August had something going on behind the scenes. Well, last week we got some tea that was a little too strong for me. I don't even know if it was tea. August came out and expressed that Will gave him his blessing to date Jada and that for years of his life, he dedicated himself to her. I actually sat down with Will. I totally gave myself to that relationship for years of my life, you know? And I truly and really, really deeply loved and have a ton of love for her. After all the commotion, the R&B singer's comments started. Jada and Will's publicist came out denying all of his claims, to which he put out a statement saying it was all love, but no one was sideswiped by his actions. This then prompted Jada to bring herself to the Red Table Talk because some healing needed to happen. Now, she did bring herself to the table alongside her husband, Will, who literally looked as stressed as he did in the pursuit of happiness. So what happened, Jada? Okay, so, you know, you and I were going through a very difficult time. Yeah. And we decided... I was done with your you, ass. Yeah, you kicked me to I the curb. I was curve. done with you. Yeah. At that particular point in time, it was indefinite. Yeah, I really felt like we could be over. You yeah, know? no, and, we were over. And then what did you do, Jada? Now, Will and Jada make it clear that the separation seemed indefinite at the time, but Jada still couldn't find the right words to explain her relations with Alzina. I think um, you need to say clearly what happened. As far as what? You and I decided we were going to take our space and what happened. Yeah, and then I got into an entanglement with August. That's what I said. An entanglement? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes. A relationship. Yes, it was a relationship, absolutely. Jada's Red Table Talk episode broke the viewing record for Facebook Watch with more than 12 million views in less than 24 hours. So naturally, everyone has seen it from memes and jokes to even celebrities having a field day with her wordplay. 50 Cent even went as far as to DM Will, asking if he was all right, to which he responded graciously, thanking him for his concern. But y'all know 50 likes to instigate, mentioning that Jada said only she could give permission to do the do with her, which Will wasn't feeling as gracious anymore, signing off with an F you. Despite everything that's happened, Will does affirm to Jada that he will get his revenge in due time. I'm gonna get you back first. And then you gonna get me back. I think you've got me back. <laughs> I think you <laughs> I think we're good on that, okay? I think we ain't doing yet. Ugh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Jada seems very toxic. This relationship between them seems very toxic. Like, uh, bad marriage for life. Like, is we gonna skip by that? Like you didn't just say that, because that's really not like the goal. I don't know. Let me know in the comments. What do you guys think? Do you think it's toxic? Do you think it's a partnership that only they can figure out? Let me know. Don't forget to like, subscribe, sub, subscribe, subscribe. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. And don't forget to follow you with the T's Instagram account. That way you can get all your latest entertainment news, unless I'm at work or busy. But I'll try my best. All right, guys. Love you. Bye.